forecast. But it is clear, all right? So we will have the sunshine. Thankfully, roadways are dry, and we are not starting off with the rain like we did yesterday. So back to work and school, headed out the driveways, layered up with those temperatures in the 30s. A calm breeze to start. A little bit of a north wind as you get the day going closer to the coast, and that will pick up, especially at the beaches as well in Jacksonville. But we do come home to more sunshine, 64 degrees or so, uh, give or take. Now knock off a couple degrees at the coast because we will see that wind sustained around 10 miles an hour or so. Gusts of 15, maybe 18 miles an hour or so, just shy of about 20 today. So again, a bit gusty. And the ICW River, still a little bit of a chop out there. Water temperature out toward Mayport, uh, still clocking in the upper 50s. All right, a little bit warmer as you do head down the ICW, maybe toward Palm Valley. We're in those lower 60s. All right, uh, surf heights right now about three feet or so. So still rough out there. Seas four to six. High tide 515 for my salt lifers. That puts low tide at 11:45 today, and that sun will be up right about 7 a.m. It'll set at about 6:20 this evening. We're going to keep those temperatures again in the upper 50s, lower 60s at the coast today. Now, last night was perfect. Perfect. All right, I had to do a little research of my own, watching the ships go in and out of Mayport during the golden hour. Also noticing that moon that was right directly above us, and it's actually headed toward that full moon phase. So it's a full snow moon in the month of February that will peak on Saturday. Those moonrise times leading up to it, of course, just before sunrise, uh, sunset on Friday, and then right around or just after sunset on Saturday, then 730 on Sunday. This is actually in the apogee phase, so it's the micro moon, although it's still going to appear bright and beautiful and big. It's 250,000 miles and change from Earth, if you were curious. All right, it's at its farthest point in the moon's orbit from Earth. Now, our real field temperatures right about that moonrise time today are going to be in the 60s, okay? Coming up on the east about 3 o'clock for that nice snow moon. And then into this evening, we lose that sun. We're in the 50s. And then tomorrow morning, we wake up yet again with those chills and those temperatures in the 30s. We do gradually warm up, though, but it's not until Thursday, and it's brief with cold front blowing in on.